Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. We are back at it again with some Watch Dogs, more specifically the Bad Blood Story expansion. So we pretty much have reached the end of the story within Bad Blood. We only have one more main mission left to go, and we have officially concluded the story expansion. Now, I don't remember exactly where we left off, but if I had to guess, we're at a point in the story where we had to fend off Default's thugs from coming after T-Bone and Tobias at the silo, and after we finished taking those guys out, we then had to get a location as to where Default is currently holed up, and thankfully Tobias was able to help us out with that, so now we can finally go there and actually put an end to Default. Alright, let's do this. Drop on default? No. He's orchestrated this every step of the way so far. I don't see him taking any chances. He'll have a plan B. Garen fucking teed. All right. Let's see here. Nice and discreet. This is rare for default. I bet it gets weirder on the inside. He's made this personal between us. He doesn't want to just kill me. He wants to crucify me on camera. If I remember right, I don't think this area specifically was present in the PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360 versions of Watch Dogs. See if I can trick these doors into opening. And off we go. Welcome. I see you down there, Fruer. I can open your door from here. Stay low. You know me. Can't get much lower. Why do you do that? Do what? Insult yourself, man. Self-deprecation. You need to cut that shit out, buddy. Okay, okay. Alright, let's see. you inside. Some of these guys must have access codes to get further in. Eeny, meeny, miny. Hell and heaven. <laughs> I like how they designed that. We 
got an enforcer. No. Yeah, they split up the code. We're gonna need another mole. Alright, I'm still in the clear. What am I seeing over there? I thought that was gonna alert everybody, but thankfully, that wasn't the case. Blazing, I guess. Signal's close. Do you see it? Yeah. This ain't gonna be easy. You tell me where to go. I trust you. Alright, let's see here. Oh, man. I saw that guy look the other way, so I thought that would have made Tobias free to be able to go to where I needed him to go. Alright, let's do this again. Gotta wait for this guy to look the other way. Now, go, go! Alright. Okay, move. Move up. I thought this guy would have heard it to where he would have went over here. There we go. Now, go. Go, stay low. There we go. I'm through. Can you get the door for me? Yep. Well, not my problem. 
Are we getting close? They've changed the place around, but if the building still matches the blueprint, we should be close to the central room now. Good. Good. I'll meet you there. I am Dog from the machine. Can't stop. Search over there. I am the rats in the walls. All right, well, they're going guns blazing. Might as well do the same. There was no one right there. Let's find him. I can see you, Ray. These frequency sounds are messing with my accuracy. man dude are you kidding me dude Finally! Jesus Christ, man, these enemies were annoying. Suffering from the same damn guilt that's been eating me up all these years. Now, I'm sorry I did what I did. And I'm sorry that this fucknut dragged you back into it. But even if I deserve this, you don't. You don't. Yes, we've got our heads. So long, Ray. Bye-bye. Hey. Sayonara. Adios. Hold up your phone! Hold up your damn phone!
There's a little rat. dead there for a second like dead dead like I couldn't even tell if you were breathing and then I thought you'd get all like pissed off if, if I went to call an ambulance uh, Tobias. yeah I'm fine why do you got that shit-eating grin on your face I think you must have inhaled some of these fumes for it's possible look Ray I was thinking I don't know if I really want to leave Chicago anymore do you more than anything else I've ever wanted in my whole life. Oh. oh but hey. <coughs> Let's say I do stick around. Hypothetically speaking. Try and find the, the chink in Bloom's armor. Would you help me? Absolutely. <laughs> the old team's back together again. Well, minus the one. Yeah, well, that's okay because I got somebody in mind. Aiden Pierce. But are you serious? Wait, that guy has mental issues. Do you know how we met? He introduced himself with a tactical baton. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that sounds like something he'd do. <laughs> but that, that's not funny. But no. It's not fun. I'm sorry. Must be the fumes. <laughs> uh, what is that? Uh, apparently, it's called a wet Zambezi. What happened to the beer I bought you? I had to pour it out. It smelled awful. It smelled like beer. Yeah. Well, this smells like fruit. Oh, that is foul. That doesn't taste like fruit at all. <laughs> oh. Well, no, wait for it. Oh, there it is. It has like a fruity aftertaste. Mm. Maybe I should just get a juice. <laughs> you are hopeless, Fruer. <laughs> now it's your turn. What's that? Quinkies. I got you a double dog donut combo. No. Well, come on, Ray, just try it, just a bite. I mean, there's a reason why the chain is so successful. Yeah, because they pump addictive chemicals into the special sauce. You know, yeah. that's what I thought, too. It's just mayonnaise and relish. Come on, man, I drank with you. That tropical monstrosity is not a drink. It doesn't count. Ray? I'm gonna make you eat this fucking burger. No. Try it. No. Just a bite. No, bite look, it, right? I will taste Ray, you. I Back swear off. to eat the. Jesus, Harold Christ. Ah, oh, come on, it's not that bad. Oh God damn it! It's delicious. <laughs> and that was the Bad Blood Story Expansion. I'm not even gonna lie, dude. 
Even though Watch Dogs is 10 years old, I can honestly say that the Bad Blood DLC expansion, not only is it one of the best pieces of downloadable content that Ubisoft has ever put together, but I would even go as far as to say that this is one of the best pieces of downloadable content they've ever produced. Like, I genuinely loved playing through this and just being able to explore Chicago and try to expose Bloom through the eyes of T-Bone. Like, I really enjoyed doing all of this once again. I was kind of confused as to when this story took place within the main story of Aiden Pierce. And I eventually realized that this story expansion, it took place around the time when Aiden, he found out that Default was at Dot Connection, or as it was formerly known as the Ambrose Theater. And Aiden, when he found out that Default was there, he ended up going on a wild goose chase to try to take him out. And while Default apparently, apparently he didn't die after being taken out by Aiden, even though we saw throughout the walkthrough that we did as Aiden it looked as if default had died at the hands at the hands of Aiden but turns out that wasn't the case but regardless of how that transpired T-Bone eventually was able to take out default and put an end to all of his antics that he had concocted but now that we have finally completed the bad blood story expansion as much as it breaks my heart to say this but that concludes the 10th anniversary series of Watch Dogs. And the reason why I say that it breaks my heart is because I genuinely enjoyed playing through this game as a way of celebrating its 10 year anniversary. I really enjoyed doing a series on this game and being able to show you guys exactly how experienced I've gotten with playing a game like this, whether it's in the single player aspect or whether it's in the multiplayer aspect. I enjoyed coming back to this game and just doing a series on it for you guys to witness with me. As a matter of fact, I think I can confidently say that this series has been the most successful series that I have done on my YouTube channel so far. Like, you guys have brought in the views, the reception has been very positive from the looks of it, and all in all, you guys have seemed to have enjoyed this a whole lot more than the other series that I have done in the past, which... I was not expecting whatsoever, so I do want to take a moment to say thank you guys so much for it. It really means a lot to me. Now, for anybody who might be curious, I won't be able to do a playthrough on Watch Dogs 2 and Watch Dogs Legion, and it's mainly due to the fact that I no longer own those games, but if I happen to get a copy of those games again at some point in the future, then I might consider doing a series on one of those games, but for now, I was only able to do a series on the first Watch Dogs specifically. With that being said, the 10th anniversary series of Watch Dogs has concluded. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching me play through this game for a series. I hope you guys enjoyed reminiscing about how good this game was and still is 10 years later. If you guys enjoyed today's video, you're more than welcome to drop a like on it. And if you enjoy this type of content, you're more than welcome to hit that subscribe button and that bell notification. But until then, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you so much for the support that you have given me and the videos in this series. It's been your boy Discreet, and I'll catch you in the next video.